The halalkanes are a group of chemical compounds derived from alkanes containing one or more halogens. They are a subset of the general class of halocarbons, although the distinction is not often made. Halalkanes are widely used commercially and, consequently, are known under many chemical and commercial names. They are used as flame retardants, fire extinguishants, refrigerants, propellants, solvents, and pharmaceuticals. Subsequent to the widespread use in commerce, many halocarbons have also been shown to be serious pollutants and toxins. For example, the chlorofluorocarbons have been shown to lead to ozone depletion. Methyl bromide is a controversial fumigant. Only halolcanes which contain chlorine, bromine, and iodine are a threat to the ozone layer, but fluorinated volatile halolcanes in theory may have activity as greenhouse gases. Methyl iodide, a naturally occurring substance, however, does not have ozone depleting properties in the United States Environmental Protection Agency has designated the compound non-ozone layer depleter. For more information, see halomethane. Halolcan or orcal halides are the compounds which have the general formula a euro cubed or x a euro cubed where r is an orcal or substituted orcal group and x is a halogen. Halolcanes have been known for centuries. Chloroethane was produced synthetically in the 15th century. The systematic synthesis of such compounds developed in the 19th century in step with the development of organic chemistry and the understanding of the structure of alkanes. Methods were developed for the selective formation of C halogen bonds. Especially versatile methods included the addition of halogens to alkanes, hydrohalogenation of alkanes, and the conversion of alcohols to orcal halides. These methods are so reliable and so easily implemented that halolcanes became cheaply available for use in industrial chemistry because the halide could be further replaced by other functional groups. While most halolcanes are human produced, non artificial source halolcanes do occur on Earth, mostly through enzyme mediated synthesis by bacteria, fungi, and especially C. macroalgae. More than 1,600 halogenated organics have been identified with bromelcanes being the most common halolcanes. Brominated organics in biology range from biologically produced methyl bromide to non-alkan aromatics and unsaturates. Halogenated alkanes in land plants are more rare, but do occur, as for example the flanoroacetate produced is a toxin by at least 40 species of known plants. Specific dehalogenase enzymes in bacteria which remove halogens from halolcanes, are also known. Classes of halolcanes, from the structural perspective, halolcanes can be classified according to the connectivity of the carbon atom to which the halogen is attached. In primary halolcanes, the carbon that carries the halogen atom is only attached to one other orcal group. An example is chloroethane, CH, 3 CH, 2 centiliters. In secondary halolcanes, the carbon that carries the halogen atom has two car euro C bonds. In tertiary halolcanes, the carbon that carries the halogen atom has three car euro C bonds. Halolcanes can also be classified according to the type of halogen. Halolcanes containing carbon bonded to fluorine, chlorine, bromine, and iodine results in organofluorine, organochlorine, organobromine, and organoiodine compounds, respectively. Compounds containing more than one kind of halogen are also possible. Several classes of widely used halolcanes are classified in this way chlorofluorocarbons, hydrochlorofluorocarbon S and hydrofluorocarbons. These abbreviations are particularly common in discussions of the environmental impact of halolcanes. Properties, halolcanes generally resemble the parent alkanes in being colorless, relatively odorless, and hydrophobic. Their boiling points are higher than the corresponding alkanes and scale with the atomic weight and number of halides. This is due to the increased strength of the intermolecular force C euro from London dispersion to dipole-dipole interaction because of the increased polarity. Thus carbon tetraodide, Ci, 4, is a solid whereas carbon tetrafluoride, Cf, 4, is a gas. As they contain fewer car euro H bonds, Halocarbons are less flammable than alkanes, and some are used in fire extinguishers. Halolcanes are better solvents than the corresponding alkanes because of their increased polarity. 
while alkanes containing halogens other than fluorine are more reactive than the parent alkanes are euro it is this reactivity that is the basis of most controversies. Many are alkylating agents, with primary halolcanes and those containing heavier halogens being the most active. The ozone depleting abilities of the CFCs arises from the photolability of the car euro CL bond. Occurrence, halolcanes are of wide interest because they are widespread and have diverse beneficial and detrimental impacts. The oceans are estimated to release 1 to 2 million tons of bromomethane annually. A large number of pharmaceuticals contain halogens, especially fluorine. An estimated one-fifth of pharmaceuticals contain fluorine, including several of the most widely used drugs. Examples include 5-fluorouracil, fluoxetine, peroxetine, ciprofloxacin, meflokine, and fluconazole. The beneficial effects arise because the CF bond is relatively unreactive. Fluorine substituted ethers are volatile anesthetics, including the commercial products methoxyfluorane, influorane, isofluorane, sevofluorane and desfluorane. Fluorocarbon anesthetics reduce the hazard of flammability with diethyl ether and cyclopropane. Perfluorinated alkanes are used as blood substitutes. Chlorinated or fluorinated alkanes undergo polymerization. Important halogenated polymers include polyvinyl chloride, and polytetrafluoroethane. The production of these materials releases substantial amounts of wastes. Nomenclature, IUPAC, the formal naming of halolcanes should follow IUPAC nomenclature, which put the halogen as a prefix to the arcan. For example, ethane with bromine becomes bromoethane, methane with four chlorine groups becomes tetrachloromethane. However, many of these compounds have already an established trivial name, which is endorsed by the IUPAC nomenclature, for example chloroform and methylene chloride. For unambiguity, this article follows the systematic naming scheme throughout. Production Halolcanes can be produced from virtually all organic precursors. From the perspective of industry, the most important ones are alkanes and alkanes. From alkanes Alkanes react with halogens by free radical halogenation. In this reaction a hydrogen atom is removed from the arcan, then replaced by a halogen atom by reaction with a diatomic halogen molecule. The reactive intermediate in this reaction is a free radical and the reaction is called a radical chain reaction. Free radical halogenation typically produces a mixture of compounds mono or multihalogenated at various positions. It is possible to predict the results of a halogenation reaction based on bond dissociation energies and the relative stabilities of the radical intermediates. Another factor to consider is the probability of reaction at each carbon atom, from a statistical point of view. Due to the different dipole moments of the product mixture, it may be possible to separate them by distillation. From alkanes and alkanes, in hydrohalogenation. An alkane reacts with a dry hydrogen halide like hydrogen chloride or hydrogen bromide to form a monohalolcan. The double bond of the alkane is replaced by two new bonds, one with the halogen and one with the hydrogen atom of the hydrohalic acid. Markovnikov's rule states that in this reaction, the halogen is more likely to become attached to the more substituted carbon. This is an electrophilic addition reaction. Water must be absent otherwise there will be a side product of a holohydrin. The reaction is necessarily to be carried out in a dry inert solvent such as CCL, for or directly in the gaseous phase. The reaction of orkins are similar, with the product being a geminal dilid. Once again, Markovnikov's rule is followed. Alkanes also react with halogens to form halolcanes with two neighboring halogen atoms in a halogen addition reaction. Orkins react similarly, forming the tetrahalo compounds. This is sometimes known as decolorizing the halogen, since the reagent X2 is colored and the product is usually colorless and odorless. From alcohols, alcohol undergoes nucleophilic substitution reaction by halogen acid to give halolcanes. Tertiary alkanol reacts with hydrochloric acid directly to produce tertiary chloroalkan, but if primary or secondary alkanol is used, an activator such as zinc chloride is needed. This reaction is exploited in the Lucas test. 
the most popular conversion is effected by reacting the alcohol with thionyl chloride, SOCl, 2, in the Datsun's process, which is one of the most convenient laboratory methods because the byproducts are gaseous. Both phosphorus pentachloride, PCL, 5, and phosphorus trichloride, PCL, 3, also convert the hydroxyl group to the chloride. Alcohols may likewise be converted to bromalkanes using hydrobromic acid or phosphorus tribromide. A catalytic amount of PBr, 3 may be used for the transformation using phosphorus and bromine. PBr, 3 is formed in situ. Iodolcanes may similarly be prepared using red phosphorus and iodine. The APLA reaction is also useful for preparing orchal halides. The reagent is tetrahalomethane and triphenylphosphine. The co-products are haloform and triphenylphosphine oxide. From carboxylic acids, two methods for the synthesis of halolcanes from carboxylic acids are the Hunstiecker reaction and the Quachai reaction. Biosynthesis, many chloro and bromolcanes are formed naturally. The principal pathways involve the enzymes chloroperoxidase and bromoperoxidase. Reactions Halolcanes are reactive towards nucleophiles. They are polar molecules. The carbon to which the halogen is attached is slightly electropositive, where the halogen is slightly electronegative. This results in an electron deficient carbon which, inevitably, attracts nucleophiles. Substitution Substitution reactions involve the replacement of the halogen with another molecular euro, thus leaving saturated hydrocarbons, as well as the halogenated product. Halolcanes behave as the R plus synthon, and readily react with nucleophiles. Hydrolysis, a reaction in which water breaks a bond, is a good example of the nucleophilic nature of halolcanes. The polar bond attracts a hydroxide ion, O a euro being a common source of this ion. This O a euro is a nucleophile with a clearly negative charge, as it has excess electrons it donates them to the carbon, which results in a covalent bond between the two. Thus car euro X is broken by heterolytic fission resulting in a halide ion, Zau euro. As can be seen, the OH is now attached to the orchal group, creating an alcohol reaction with ammonia give primary amines. Chloro and bromelcanes are readily substituted by iodide in the Finkelstein reaction. The iodolcanes produced easily undergo further reaction. Sodium iodide is used thus as a catalyst. Halolcanes react with ionic nucleophiles. The halogen is replaced by the respective group. This is of great synthetic utility, chloroalkanes are often inexpensively available. For example, after undergoing substitution reactions, cyanolcanes may be hydrolyzed to carboxylic acids, or reduced to primary amines using lithium aluminium hydride. Azolcanes may be reduced to primary amines by the Staudinger reduction or lithium aluminium hydride. Amines may also be prepared from orchal halides in anorchylation, the Gabriel synthesis and Dilepian reaction, by undergoing nucleophilic substitution with potassium thalamide or hexamine respectively, followed by hydrolysis. In the presence of a base, halolcanes orchylate alcohols, amines, and THIOLS to obtain ethers and substituted amines, and the oiters respectively. They are substituted by grinard reagents to give magnesium salts and an extended orchal compound. Mechanism, where the rate determining step of a nucleophilic substitution reaction is unimolecular, it is known as an SN1 reaction. In this case, the slowest is the heterolysis of a carbon halogen bond to give a carbocation and the halide anion. The nucleophile attacks the carbocation to give the product. SN1 reactions are associated with the racemization of the compound, as the trigonal planar carbocation may be attacked from either face. They are favored mechanism for tertiary halolcanes, due to the stabilization of the positive charge on the carbocation by three electron donating orchal groups. They are also preferred where the substituents are sterically bulky, hindering the SN2 mechanism. Elimination. Rather than creating a molecule with the halogen substituted with something else, one can completely eliminate both the halogen and a nearby hydrogen, thus forming an alkene by dehydrohalogenation. For example, with bromoethane and sodium hydroxide in ethanol, 
The hydroxide ion HO abstracts a hydrogen atom. Bromide ion is then lost, resulting in ethylene, H2O and NABR. Thus, halalkanes can be converted to alkanes. Similarly, dihalalkanes can be converted to alkanes. In related reactions, 1, 2 dibromo compounds are debrominated by zinc dust to give alkanes and geminal dilates can react with strong bases to give carbons. Other Halalkanes undergo free radical reactions with elemental magnesium to give archaeal magnesium compounds, grinid reagents. Halalkanes also react with lithium metal to give organolithium compounds. Both grinid reagents and organolithium compounds behave as the asynthon. Alkali metals such as sodium and lithium are able to cause halalkanes to couple in the Wurtz reaction, giving symmetrical alkanes. Halalkanes, especially iodalkanes, also undergo oxidative addition reactions to give organometallic compounds. Applications Halalkanes are widely used as synthon equivalents to orchal cation in organic synthesis. They can also participate in a wide variety of other organic reactions. Short chain halalkanes such as dichloromethane, trichloromethane, and tetrachloromethane are commonly used as hydrophobic solvents in chemistry. They were formerly very common in industry. However, their use has been greatly curtailed due to their toxicity and harmful environmental effects. Chlorofluorocarbons were used almost universally as refrigerants and propellants due to their relatively low toxicity and high heat of vaporization. Starting in the 1980s, as their contribution to ozone depletion became known, their use was increasingly restricted, and they have now largely been replaced by HFCs. See also, halogenation, halomethane, halogenorine, references.